from the secret life event at the end of the season to the brand new Falcon Scout. Here are 24 secrets in this Fortnite mid-season update. Please like, subscribe, and use code SMJM. Guys, here is a trailer for the brand new Falcon Scout, which has finally been added to the game since we first saw it in the trailer. Now, initially, we thought this was just to literally scout your enemies. And once you've seen the enemies, you can ping them. But there is a lot of other things you can do with this. You can pick up your friend's reboot card, loot. And as you can see right here, if your friend is down, you can literally pick them up. And obviously, while you're using this, your camera angle changes. So just like the guided missile, you will be vulnerable while you're using this item. A brand new bush grenade has been added to the game. You can see this gameplay. You can literally throw this item and a bush will appear out of nowhere. And according to these stats, you can do 100 damage to your opponent. And it looks like if you stack them, you can literally spam them as you can see right here. Imagine using this with Bush Warrior perk. Now, as we all know, that Kid Leroy is going to be our next icon series. And also, we are getting a concert as well. Now, this Kid Leroy emote was added to this game. You can see right here. Also, I'm not playing the song for copyright reasons, but the song for this emote is Stay by Justin Bieber and Kid Leroy. And it looks like Justin Bieber might make an appearance in this concert as well. Now, Deku's smash mythic weapon was vaulted a few weeks ago because there was a lot of bugs. This mythic weapon has been re-enabled and you can find them in Battle Royale the build mode and zero build mode. Guys, we finally have brand new perks. This has been one of my favorite thing this chapter. And to be honest with you, I was kind of getting bored of those perks. The first one is called Danger Hero. Briefly regenerate health and gain movement speed when your shield breaks. Peely's Plunder. Receive a treasure map that will lead you to buried treasure. Shotgun Striker. Shotgun gives you siphon on hits against players. Rarity Check. You gain siphon on elimination with common or uncommon weapons. Zero Chance. Gain a zero point dash when you break an enemy's shield. Fortnite X Dead Space collaboration has been confirmed. According to Hypex, in the next two weeks, this is going to be released as a pack that includes one outfit, two backpacks, one pickaxe, one built-in emote, and 1,500 V-Bucks. It looks like we are getting Peter Griffin skins very soon because Fortnite has been working on a male skin codenamed French Fry. And in the files, they had like images of a family guy seen when Peter Griffin is having a fight with a chicken. So we might get skins like Peter Griffin, maybe this chicken, Stewie, Brian. Brand new skins has been added to the game as well. First one's the Rift Warden. Now everyone thought this guy, which was in the surveys to be Rift Warden. And now we know that that is not true because this is Rift Warden. It comes with two different styles with and without the mask. And this guy is going to be an important part of the storyline going forward. We are going to have a bunch of quests related to this guy. And according to one of the quest lines, his goal is to take over different realities. Lucian West is another skin that we are getting. And also this guy comes with a bundle. The first time we saw this guy was in the crew pack of December in loading screen. Mind's Eye Battle Pass Back Bling has a new style. It's called Exile and this is how it looks like. And here are all of the cosmetics that we are going to see in the upcoming weeks. Now let me tell you a bit more about the Kid Leroy concert. Now we are going to get a Kid Leroy icon skin. You can see a bunch of these assets added to the game. Now this concert is a creative creative concert so it's most likely not going to take place on the map like your normal concert like travis scott bunch of these things were added to the file and will be released during the kid leroy's concert sunburst gauntlet complete five wild dreams quest the kid leroy wild dreams wild dreams bonus goals dance at the kid leroy's wild dreams after party defeat the beast at the kid leroy's concert now this suggests to me 
see that we will be going to like a creative map where the concert is going to take place. I hope it's not going to be on the screen. It looks like there's going to be like some kind of monster that we have to defeat. A bunch of quests has been added to the game that reveals the storyline of Fortnite in chapter four. Stellan, who is this guy, says this. My task said by ageless champion is to create a stable rift gate, a bridge to new realities. Now the ageless champion he's referring to is Geno, and the rift gate is actually the gate that has been constructed near Citadel. And from this dialogue, we know that Geno is the one who wants this rift gate constructed, and he has asked the warden to build this rift gate, and he's going to use this rift gate to access into different realities. Now, Stellan also warns us that there is a being, a shapeless man. He watches us with a dark purpose. Now, this shape this man the Stalin is referring is the nothing. Now, we heard a little bit about the nothing at the end of chapter three. Now, if you guys don't know, the nothing is going to be our villain going forward. And this guy is nothing. It literally has no shape. It just has a voice. Now, we will be introduced to this nothing, hopefully at the end of the season, if we get a live event, which is very most likely, if not next season. Now, it looks like we are finally getting Miles Morales, guys, because Epic Games has re-added tons of animation files regarding the Web Slingers. Obviously, the Web Slingers were removed from the game once the Spider-Man collaboration ended. And since they have re-added all of the animation, that means it is coming back. And the only way they would bring this back is if there is a new Spider-Man skin that is coming. And obviously, the only Spider-Man skins that's left now is Miles Morales. I mean, Miles Morales has been teased for all the way back in Chapter 3 of Season 1 to Fortnite X Marvel comic books. Now, we're expecting two different Miles Morales skins. One, the comic book version, and another one, the movie version. Exactly like how they did with the Spider-Man skin. And again, we are going to get the web slingers back. And I think they're going to work the same, but it's going to look a slightly different. Now, there is a possibility, guys, that we... We are going to get a Stranger Things collaboration happen again because Fortnite added a Stranger Things cosmetic and I think this is actually like a teaser of what's to come. And also remember guys, they also added the emote Metallica's song that played in the Stranger Things show. Now I got a feeling that they are going to have like a Stranger Things live event where they're going to have all the shadow monsters, maybe even have like Vecna. We know that we are going to get a Stranger Things finale very soon. And this would be a perfect collaboration with Fortnite. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and use code SMJAM. My name is Sam Jam. Peace out.